Greetings and salutations, everyone, and welcome to Let's Play Sanitarium. I'm Kamchak Fisco, and come join me for a psychological dive. going to be very inceptionist meta. It looks like a toy chest. It's rocking all by itself. An old dollhouse. This is too creepy. So we need to give the doll to ourselves. <laughs> that makes sense. You found it after all these years. Sorry it took so long. I'm so sorry. Don't be sad, Max. I thought... I thought I let you down when you needed me most. No, don't think that. You, you could never let me down. You're my hero. <laughs> hero? You're trying to save all those kids. I know you can do it. I love you. I love you too. So clearly we're the ones who made the drug that's Don't killing worry. people. I'll watch over him. Goodbye, Sarah. It's time for me to face the future. Rest well. How are we in the asylum but we see our dead sister? Just a child. Could it have died here? Please, I've had enough of the circus. To say the least. What the fuck? That's clearly our sister's corpse and uh, their, her toy. Exactly how much of this is fucking real, cripes. This gate is shut tight. What could be so important inside? So we're allegedly back in reality. What a strange device. I wonder what it controls. A well, very Frankenstein-esque. Doesn't seem to be working. Must need power first. Hmm. What a strange device. I wonder what it controls. There's a hexagonal hole at this pipe junction. So hmm. we need a wheel. What a strange device. Okay, so it's the same thing for all I wonder it. what it controls. All right. Yeah, I haven't touched this since the very first time I ever played it, so I, I don't remember anything. I just remember it's very fucked up and dark. Which is hilarious, because there are some games I remember with perfect clarity, and there's so many that I don't, and it's like, why is there a difference? Stern-looking fellow? Where do I know him from? I forgot Spiritsman was here. <laughs> God damn it. Is that our dad? Impressive, isn't it? Yes. The artist really captured his strength in this pose. I'd introduce you to him, but he's, um, visiting my mother. Oh, it's his dad. She's been feeling run down lately, so my father thought it best that she get some rest at the clinic. I guess we should be going. We don't, uh... Jacob? I wasn't expecting you. I assumed with finals coming up next week that you'd be spending your time in the library. Instead, I find you here, wasting valuable time. I've more than prepared for the finals, Father. You needn't be concerned. I'll do just fine. You'll do just fine? Fine. Is that your goal? I thought I taught you better than that. What are those kind of dads? I do fine. I don't want you to be just like every other student at medical school turns wow, out. Wow, he put it in us. Remain focused on what is important, Jacob. Yes, Father. What a dick. I don't want you to be like every Feel other student. Dizzy. Points at us. What a dumbass. Huh. A pipe valve. Strange thing to hide behind a painting. Sneaky like ninja. This clock is running counterclockwise. The time is one o'clock and the alarm is set to eight. Weird. A radio. Wonder if I can get any news from the outside world. 
Today, the world mourns as children who successfully responded to the Hope drug begin to die. Is that what we found out, that the drug wouldn't work? Or did we find a way to fix that? This clock is running... Okay, that's the same. And nothing over here. All right, so we have the, the valve. Ugh. Oh, I can't look Whoever at built this place loves ominous stone figures. No oh, shit. All right. Good old Resident Evil style of, no, you need the square peg. No, you need the hexagonal peg. No, you need the octagonal peg. This does not look like a normal machine. Well, let's see if that accomplished anything. What a strange device. I wonder what it controls. Guess all we do is turn it on. Not from here. You can't walk over there when I click interact. Come on, man. It seems that the rotating electromagnet is linked to the stone weight. But what is the machine's purpose? I, oh, oh. We have to release all of them. All right. Now that's all but these two. Shit. Oh man, these kinds of puzzles always make my head hurt. Not literally, I've never actually had that, where people say that the puzzle literally made your head hurt. It's like, how the hell would that happen? That'll get that one. But we still have these that are off-centered. I don't, is that right? Got it! Pay with that subscription. Acknowledged. Well, Mitch, just resubscribe to Tail Hat. Interesting. It's gonna be so weird streaming when he does and hearing his alerts go off. Okay, we opened the gate. That's what it did. Got it. That is a weird mechanism. Oh my god. Oh, it looks fuck. like a slaughterhouse. What were you doing with the patients here, dude? Let me help you. God, such an idiot. Patience is the key, Max. Never let the problem get the better of you. You know, I wasn't always this brilliant. <laughs> I don't believe you. Oh, I used to botch my lab tests constantly, but I stuck with it and learned from my mistakes. You're my brightest student, Max, and you have the most potential out of all your classmates. Oh, come on. We still have a lot of work to do. Clearly we have a lot of potential. We're the one who came up with here. Keep seeing things. Who would butcher these people like this? Depends on what results oh, he was God. trying to get. It's terrible. Was this what our mentor was doing to try to get the answers? What the fuck? Hmm. The local authorities are becoming increasingly suspicious of events here at the asylum. To ensure that my research continues unabated, I must rewrite the locking code for the back lab and move the subject's bodies down to the crematorium before the sheriff arrives for an inspection. The chalkboards must also be washed clean, for they contain the encrypted code. Hey, Dr. To... Morgan, uh, yeah, we looked everywhere, but we ain't been able to find them. What? That's the third time this week. Uh, but I mean, uh, I mean, maybe... Spare me your insight. You're pathetic. A man cannot vanish into <laughs> both of you. Get this wretch out of here. He's too damn old for my purposes. As for our missing patient, I'll find him myself. Yeah, but what about this stuff? Uh, shouldn't we ought to clean up here? I mean, before the inspection. I mean, I'm uh... aware of it. We'll take care of this mess after we find him. Is that what happened? Mm. Are we... Did we find the cure and he wanted to steal credit for it? So he had us institutionalized and we didn't actually snap? Oh god. It's terrible. Yuck. 
And maybe we came up with a breakthrough and we tried to escape with the car. Too far away. I feel like this is way too simple for what we're being told. I have a feeling there's a message hidden in this rambling mess. I search in vain for the elusive solution to this, a most intriguing puzzle. Evading me the way a mouse does a cat, the source of insanity remains hidden from me. Darting from flesh to muscle, muscle to bone, and back again to the fortress of the mind, this evil seems always to maintain one step ahead of me. How can I trap what I cannot see? Surely I am close to the source by now. Eventually it must rest, and when it does, I will be there to ensnare this beast. Once removed from its host, I am confident that it will wither and die like the weed that it is. Knowing now how difficult it is to find this hidden monster, I am led to believe that the age of my test subjects may be a factor. Younger subjects tend to display less evidence of infection. What infection? The madness is so entrenched within the aged frames of my older subjects that it is nearly impossible to discern the sane tissue from the insane. That's not how brain cells work. Does he just know which letter I need? Oh, is it the first of every sentence? That can't be right. So these are the letters we had to work with, and I clearly can't add more than what we have. All right, there's got to be a clue telling us how this works. There's some kind of electronic security system on this door. We don't have the code. Damn! What was I thinking? Who would butcher these people like this? So it's How just a tape. The... It's, there's, okay, I'm gonna listen to the tape again. The local authorities are becoming increasingly suspicious of events here at the asylum. To ensure that my research continues unabated, I must rewrite the, lock the locking code for the back lab and move the subject's bodies down to the crematorium before the sheriff arrives for an inspection. The chalkboards must also be washed clean, for they contain the encrypted code. Encrypted hey, Dr. Code. Morgan, uh, yeah, we looked everywhere. That's for a encrypted code. I have a feeling there's a message hidden in this rambling mess. Experiments one and two were complete failures. Unexpected complications during my exploration into the brains of the test subjects regrettably cost them their lives. The loss of a few lives is negligible when compared to the benefits that a cure may bring. Obviously, I was in air when I thought the movement sanity grew from the brain itself. Housed elsewhere within the complex frame of the human body lies the key, but where? There are so many dark avenues to explore that I hardly know where to begin. Humbled by this daunting task, I need time to regroup before I renew my search for this elusive prey. Mm. Years of research have taught me to be patient, else all could be lost in a reckless pursuit. Of so the whole sacrifice people for a cure arc, for lack of a better word. Okay. So it must be the letters are jumbled up and we have to correct them. So Oh gee. The uh -huh. the youth. We got part of the code. Okay. 
So it's a, it's a puzzle game. I have a feeling there's a Got message it. hidden in this rambling mess. So we do have to rearrange letters. It's I stand at a not cross much cross. of a cipher. Shall I venture forth to unravel the mysteries that lurk beneath the mundane flesh, or turn back in fear of what I may find? At times I feel as though the weight hey, of the rests upon my weary shoulders. Lacking any sense of direction, I have blindly followed in the footsteps of those who walked before me. Valiant, though my intentions may have been, I was powerless to stem the tide of insanity that washed against the shores of the asylum. Although conventional medicine has yielded a few encouraging results, I see no indication that an answer will be found using those methods. The timing that between his words time for perfect. conservative medicine has passed, and a new approach is necessary. Outside of the mainstream, with scalpel in hand... Why do you know what the word is? It's almost all there. I now prepare to tread upon the virgin soil of the mind. No longer bound by the archaic standards of traditional medicine, I feel reborn. So he's insane. He just, he fucking went insane. Uh -huh. Salvation. Salvation, the youth. And now we just need to figure out what the last one was. That one, I mean, literally, was salvation with the eye in the wrong place. That one was a dead giveaway. I have a feeling there's a message hidden in this rambling mess. All right, now that I understand I how the puzzle works, this should be a lot to this, a most intriguing puzzle. Evading me the way a mouse does a cat, the source of insanity remains hidden from me. Darting from flesh to muscle, muscle to bone, and back again to the porches of the mind, this evil seems always to maintain one step ahead of me. How can I trap what I cannot see? Surely I am close to the source by now. Eventually it must rest, and when it does, I will be there to ensnare this beast. Once removed from its host, I am confident that it will wither and die like the weed that it is. Knowing now how difficult it is to find this hidden monster, I am led to believe that the age of my test subjects may be a factor. Younger subjects tend to display less evidence of infection. Mm. The madness is so entrenched within the aged frames of my older subjects that it is nearly impossible to Maybe discern the sane tissue key? from the insane. Oh! Aha! Uh -huh. Key heights too, okay. That I thought it was the, it was key. That was the word on the left. Sorry I get quiet when I'm working on that. It's either that or I'm just literally saying everything that I'm thinking. So we have those three words. Too far away. Or those three sentences. The. The. Youth. Youth. Hides. Hides. Key, key to salvation. To. Salvation. Damn! Wait, that's not the order? I could have sworn that would be it. That, I mean, the youth hides the key to salvation. Wait, wait. They, 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 no, that's the wrong place. Youth, youth hides hides the, the key, key to salvation. To salvation. Youth hides the key to salvation. I had gone in the wrong place. So it wasn't the way it was on the board. We still had to mix it around. The fuck? Is this the other doctor? Us. What the fuck? He went insane. My God. Oh, fuck. Huh? And he found us. Been wandering again. If you know you can't come in, he's passing it off as we're insane. If 
you ever want to get better, you have to let me help you. I know all this must be confusing to you, even frightening. But this work is going to help so many people. Sick people. People with no hope. No! No! The Calm fuck down. do you eject this for? You're going to hurt yourself. Those straps can hold a man twice your strength. You sure about that? My personal thanks to each and every one of you for tuning in. You all are awesome viewers. Really appreciate you taking the time to watch this video. It means a lot to me, and I do hope you enjoy it. You all take care of yourselves. If you want to see more of me, come to the video on the list, or stay tuned for more. Feel free to leave a comment below. Please remember to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. In the meantime, fairly well, everyone.